I like it. Yeah, Welcome he's... to Bulwark, a game about chaotic creativity. No, right. no conventional controls, one button to paint the landscape, another to move about. And while you <laughs> paint towers and walls, people will start to make the world come alive. Keep building, that's the trick. This can be confusing at first, overwhelming even. But don't worry, there's also no mistakes. Oh, I don't like to people. There's definitely mistakes. Um... Uh... <laughs> What's it doing? There you go. Turn off that. We'll start. Uh, settings is actually what I wanted to look at. Memory counter, we can throw that on, sure. And everything else looks... Fine. Camp home mode here you get a taste of the open world building the sandbox that has a basic tutorial resource system based only on a distance rather than how much you can produce and an ever expanding set of encounters world events and unlockables. Here's the value of prosperity. Okay. I'll leave the tutorial on because I can't remember. Our people were wrecked <laughs> during the War of the Tree. Dunkel, Castellus, Moorbridge, and even Port Remit. Nothing remained of our prosperous free houses after decades of attrition. We took what we had and left in order to resettle in peace, away from the warlords and fiefdoms that remain. We will succeed, because on our backs the past was built, and from our hands the future will be wrought. Finally here, we've already built a few essential buildings. I'll assist you in connecting things up and getting the settlement up and running. We're here on the ground. We'll focus on a single building at a time. This will allow you to build outwards in a variety of ways and upwards later on. Okay. Hold middle mouse button to rotate. Yep. So first connect this outpost to the wood mill down there. Oh, that's maximum zoom? Okay. Oh, yeah, I should probably do what it says. <laughs> um, build a tower, select the nearest building, yeah. Let's say your workers are already building houses and industries along the walkway, wherever you build and our workers can reach, something happens. There's a tower over there. Build a basic tower that you to connect up your settlement and transport vital resources. Workers will also build homes and industries around it. Um, the resource flow... Um, wood can only travel a limited number of walkways away from the wood mill, but this can be increased by encouraging workers to build along walkways connected to the wood mill. 
Okay. <clears throat> Build more connecting towers. Sure. Good work. The woodmill is now delivering wood further than before, so we can move on. Got some woodmill is also a stone quarry less connected to our settlement. Yep. Do that. Now we've access to the quarry, our wooden towers can be upgraded to the stone. So we'll just hover over it and right click. Then, right, there's already a walkway there, but if I rebuild that walkway, it does go to stone, okay. I want to do that. Worth building one there, I presume it is. Let's do that. Have a seawall. Does that sound right? <clears throat> uh, select your outpost. Outpost can be upgraded as well. Let's use the stone to upgrade the outpost. Okay. You can add foundations to basic towers and outposts. These allow workers to build higher class of housing on them. Let's build a few foundations. Build more connecting tires and walkways to your outpost. Inspect worker flow. Yeah, okay. Can we build towers from here? Can build one there. Upgrade that. Flying your surveyor. Hold on, I'm not finished upgrading it. We started something more ambitious. Take this guy and seek out iron ore. Yeah, in a minute. <laughs> You've given me the ability to upgrade, so I'm going to upgrade. There's unrest on the RC. The timer lasts 20 seconds to start. Enter one of the following commands to activate. Oh, right, right, right. That's, that's for chat. tower out here. Right, anyway. Uh, space between... I've clicked the command the surveyor to fly through the cursor. Right, we're now in the thing. map uh, shows our holdings which can, we can fast travel to which will always make it will also mark any freelance captains that enter our water as well as suspicious locations gotcha i presume that's iron smelly log floater okay <laughs> um i want to go there Wherever you can build a mine on this spot, workers will mine the ore and the metallurgical industry will be built up around it. Iron will also allow more advanced towers and buildings. Peter Gunn. It needs to be transported across the water. Let's build a trade route for the ships. Okay. 
Harbors must be built in deep water close to shore. Okay, we can do that with this. Good. I will only carry iron and workers for our industries. Good. That'll do. So I need to connect that then over here. If I left clicked, like it told me to. Drop another one there. Next year, I suppose that we can start expanding it further. With iron, we can start building defensive structures such as imposing command towers. Before doing so, we need to upgrade. we have done. With all major resources now at our disposal, let's focus on building command towers. These can be built with multiple floors as well as adding additional balconies and stuff. So I can... basic or stone tower several times it becomes a command tower ah there we go go over to uh this one mighty command towers have the potential to reach into the sky their height can be increased by adding more foundations as well as having better access to workers build this tower as high as possible Keep adding to it. Make it a chunky tear. I want a command tear with five floors. Alrighty. Command tower is looking to start. We've already uh, have an experienced warbird commander among our retinue. Let's assign him to the command tower. to do that. Hold on. What am I after doing? Oh, I built another tower. <laughs> what I meant to do was... Nothing. Right, left click that. Hold the left click when it's... Uh... You will find no fine mistake. Not since the heyday of the War of the Tree. In service to our people, my retinue of falconeers is eager to settle in and get their war birds airborne. Do not delay. Rest assured, friend, my war birds are the strongest and fastest. My stable mixes Sarkand and Northern Greydive traits. War birds, the likes of which have not been seen for decades. Switch the surveyor. Oh, available actions. God, I was looking at that as um, <laughs> what I'm supposed to be doing. Our settlement is established. We have access to resources da -da -da, and command towers. Time to explore the surrounding area, finding uh, more people that will help us thrive. Indeed. So, can I get more workers over there then? We may need to accept unlikely neighbors. Or be wary of who you invite in if they bring their old alliances. Conflict is sure to follow. Gotcha. Ah, good. I can switch the building. Complete the tutorial. Lovely. So that's done. Now it's all up to you. Head out and explore. Oh, you can't build. Uh, uh, can you build towers? 
No access to wood nearby. Ah, so I need to get wood over here to get... Okay. Right, cool. Let's uh, head that way. Dude is bringing over the iron. We have our falconers with us. Who are you? We are but humble refugees. Many from the great imperial houses. Please demolish this paltry holding, and we will rebuild wherever you survey a good spot. We are but humble refugees. Many from the great imperial... Sure. I want a second outpost. This is now ours. We can switch to it like this. Now wait, can I, um... Can I actually dismantle it? Demolish, hold V. What if I don't want to demolish it? I will, but what if I don't want to? Oh, it's just demolishing a segment. Never mind. I kind of have to demolish it, right? Because it doesn't have access to wood. Should I? I don't think I should have done that. So I need to the harbor in. I will carry stone and workers only, nothing else. My ship only carries wood and workers. This isn't the best use of my vessel. Find me a better one. Be fine. Unconnected. So we need to connect that to our home base. And that will allow us to build here because we'll have wood. Eventually. Does it count straight away? It kind of does. So. Say connect it. Probably shouldn't have um, dismantled the rest of it, but hey, what can you do? It was allowing me to build there. So I need to get stone here. A new home. Seeing it prosper fills me with pride. I will carry stone and workers only. Nothing. It brings me joy to see our settlement thriving. No more restless nights for me. Should be fine. So is he actually gonna do the thing? Yes, it says stone is coming in there, right? Yeah, lovely. Okay. Turn off that. We'll upgrade this to stone. Upgrade all of this to stone. I 
even know what I'm building here. Down at the bottom there. I don't want it. I'm gonna upgrade it so it's up higher. Yeah, lovely. Upgrade that a little bit. That. No stone. Come on now. Wait for the guy to come back. Can I upgrade the quarry? Day one thing. Uh, maybe I need to be in the building. not allowing me to do anything there. We have we found our new patron. We seek trade and haulage. Something we have found our new patron. Ooh. We seek trade and haulage. So you enrolled a trade ship, Captain. They give me a sign to transport goods. Transport all the goods as well. Pretty sweet. Okay. So we'll have her there as an option then for um, the next place. Uh, what I wanted to do is actually go back in here and uh, get over here. Can I do anything here? No. Put a tower out here, though. Iron, ah, yes, okay. Iron is an issue. Keep upgrading everything. Now, yeah, that's all stone. Can we upgrade that to iron? Can and they'll start building on that. a huge citadel.
That's it? Okay. No available commanders. Okay, so if you left-click on the top, you can, um... Assign a commander to one of these, uh, upgraded outposts. Susa, thank you for the follow. Hope you're doing well. Oh, no worries, dude. I, uh, I really enjoyed the demo when it initially uh, came out. Very different, you know? That's, that's always good. Uh, we'll upgrade that. That should be fully upgraded. I need to upgrade this as well. So the hometown is fully upgraded. With the uh, iron. We'll expand that out then. That should be good. Okay. We have our outpost there. <laughs> we could get the second iron place. <clears throat> and we could have them delivered direct to that outpost. Could I have wood go from here to there? I'm wondering now if I put wood from there to there over to that outpost. Oh god. Daniela Diola, thank you for the follow. Isley, thank you for the follow. Hope you're all doing well. Why have I got. Oh. Right. Old tree. Ah. Because we've seen those guys, I guess we uh, get the um, we have we have her as captain. Okay, so we have all these guys as captains. These are who we have to hire at the moment, I guess. That is fine. For the Great War, the Imperium held the resources of the and the Macker controlled the technology. Now any petty fiefdoms wobble for what little, little remains in the RC's old re regime. Oh, that was probably for that. Okay. Um, let's head over here. I have no available resource extractors. E what now? Where do I get more resource extractors? That would be a thing. Also, there's a ship coming in that we don't know about. This one here. Aye, 
There is word amongst Freehouse traders that you offer respite for weary captains. Will you have me and my ship? Yes. There is word amongst Freehouse trade. We will. Don't know what I'm going to get you to do, but we'll have you. Is this these are hard times and thus they bring the need for uneasy alliances my group and I have been on the run for so long we seek refuge and will submit to your service I post to salvage and relocate Should it be demolishing this whole thing? I hope. <laughs> so that is now my unit, right? Yeah, he's flying with us. Sweet. Looks like it could be a nice place to settle, right? Don't quarry down there. all this so in the surveyor's hold I have can I get more of these during your travels outposts and other unique buildings you dismantle can be viewed here they can be built using the surveyor wherever you wish Okay, a group of refugees waiting to be resettled. Raise workers and be an upgrade to the citadels. How do I get more wood mills? Although sea trees are uh, the giant fungi are relatively common in the RC, the process of hardening their soft material into light, strong wood is difficult. To, therefore, wood mills and skill crews are rare. Ah. Hey, Divine Dao, how are you? Hope you're doing well. Look at everything on the other side of the world. Um, go down to the stone quarry down here, so I'll have a look at that. I presume that's pointing as home, the amber flashing one. Yeah. Stone quarry there. What's this? Been waiting for this game? Yeah, it came out like yesterday, didn't it? How was it so far? Ah, it's a lot of fun. I, I enjoyed the demo, as I was saying. What's more valuable than a warm hearth in these bleak times? Well, look no further. Master fabricator of boilers and heated houses at your service. Had some minor mishaps at my previous patron but i assure you i can deliver fabulous mark ii <gasps> what's more valuable than a war <sighs> this is mark ii whatever stories you might have heard shoddy monster welding was to blame idle gossip nothing more what's more valuable your what does that do <laughs> We've got him. That looks like a uh, pirate base there, so we might go down and uh, deal with that. I kind of want to put an outpost there. Wait. Wait a minute.
Yeah, I kind of want to put an outpost on the Volcano Island. Oh, okay, so we have to be within range to see the resources. Put the Imperials on this. Excellent, we have an outpost to provide the workers. Be mindful of an outpost allegiance as influence and balance of power in your settlement. Yep. That is true. My ship carries wood. Beautiful. This ship will haul anything and everything. Yes, you will. Trade is good and steady. Okay. And then we're going to assign her to go to the main hub. Where she can get everything. Don't mind that, that's just our second area. All the way, we could probably just connect there, right? Mac Because they're technically getting everything, except maybe iron. But I could do that. Refugee settlement has been spotted on our house. We can take these people in. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. What we do then is we pop over here. We come in here, and we're going to change this because we have a second ship. A new home. Seeing it prosper fills me with pride. It brings me joy. My ship carries wood. I'll transport anything you wish me to. Good man. It brings me joy to see our settlement thriving. I'll transport anything you... Things are improving. This route is profitable. And I've been hauling good loads. Good on you. I'll just keep all three of them on that for now. So that we get a load of resources into here. There's the other one doing that lo that run. Uh, but yeah, divine. It's um, it's good. It's good. I don't know what the like um, <clears throat> the meta progression or anything like that is. Curious to see that. I do like the building style. The unique. All the boobas. Right. But over here we will no iron available for the upgrade, okay. No stone available for the upgrade, but we're waiting on deliveries then. <clears throat> waiting on deliveries. I know there's a campaign, but I'm just curious as to what the goal is. Yeah, the controls, they take a minute to get used to, but yeah, it's fine. Let's see if we've got any resources here. We don't. It is slowly getting in wood, though, as you can see here. I think. <laughs> I'm just going to see. Uh, it doesn't correspond with them actually getting here, but okay. I would like to um, have it connected to at least the quarry over there. Oh, 
So, uh, let's head out there. Oh, actually, do you know what? Not that. Um, this inventory... Oh, I was wondering, did we get, um... We have two-point defense, and that's all we have? Okay. I was wondering, did we get an iron mine from collecting, um, that business thing? Ah, settlement. We carry no grudge. We bring no war. Only grief. But this meager holding was always a last resort. We need a more permanent home. Done. Let me just dismantle everything you own. Check it out. Mind that. Thank you very much for the uh, the gift subs, dude. Very much appreciated. First time checking this out seems interesting. Hey, Deopa. Uh, is it Daupa? Deopa? You say that. Uh, it is interesting. Yeah, it's um, it's a very chill game at this at the moment. You let me preface that by saying at the moment. A unique style of building, which is cool. I might throw our pyre thing over near Smelly Log Floater. <laughs> Actually, let's go over to Smelly Log Floater. Um, yeah, you have no available resource extractors. I need more. I think we're about to get in a fight. Maybe not. This woodman and all of its seeds in the production of the Vanalis. They say it's under our protection. Raid before trade, but we lost some good fighters. How about you send over some workers to the trade harbor, and we can send some wood in exchange? A fight! Bring it! Pretty sure I win that fight. This wood mill and all of its sea tree Oh, that it? Bring that all you have to say for yourself? A fight! Bring it! Do I want to declare war on the banner list, though? What is going on? <laughs> they had they had falconeers. Get him! I don't know who's winning. The bird is on fire. So I think their their guys are the um, well, the evil looking ones, I guess, right? Oh, they have a ship too. I do remember that, like um, the outposts. Retreat? No, we're not retreating. Oh wait, I need to go kill this guy, do I? I don't think I can attack him. I may have made a mistake. My guys, my guys can attack him, so that's okay. Oh, we lost a piece of our ship.
Yes, keep firing. Don't shoot me, you dumbass. Dodge it, dodge it, dodge it. Ooh, we're gonna be in trouble here. All right, there we go. Oh, he's dodging. Oh wait, he is literally heading to our place, isn't he? A raid is spotted. Of course, take out the resource extractor. I didn't notice this. <laughs> We're now at risk of being raided by pirates. Our wealth and prosperity is too tempting to not be taken. We need to defend ourselves. Good. Tell me how. Can we get, like, static defenses for our place? Would be my question, actually. The captain has lost her ship. Holy crap. That looks so much cooler without the sails up. Purpose a threat neutralized. I just got achievements for eliminating a hundred units. <laughs> I don't think that's true. You're joking, right? Get some pirate blood. Take it, but we will remember this slight. Right, we've conquered. Conquerors will escalate the war. We can expect the enemy to strike back stronger, attempting to lay waste your surveyor and task force. Okay. No problem. We can't upgrade because we don't have uh, access to anything except wood. The metals structure in this location, yeah. This will build a wooden bridge. Uh, right, so I need to put in a harbor. My ship carries wood. I bet it does. There's no wood here. What? Oh, right, yeah, because I don't have an extractor. I own the settlement or area, but I don't have an extractor. God damn it. But imagine if I put down a colony of that group. It's going to be hostile. I can't see where I'm flying to. We'll scrap it. Perhaps patch up your ship and escorts. There's plenty of dinks and scratches already. An old sentry tower. We can get this working again. We can salvage it. Turning it into an offensive emplacement when dropped anywhere. You can also attach it to a harbor. Making it a rallying point for your surface fleet. Ooh. Now, you say offensive, but couldn't it be defensive? So, soul tree. <laughs> I 
Yeah, we might have started something there. Now, we lost a ship, so I need to go check who that was. Well, it was actually, it was from the stone quarry, right? Additional forces have joined our battle group. We came back and got back our uh, falconeers. Find and hire some new ones. Oh, that's the iron mine. That's even worse. Um, okay. Oh, I'm at the wrong place. Am I? Okay, we have three guys going there, so I can get the, um... They're doing wooden stone. They're not doing iron, though. There's only one guy doing iron there. This reminds me I need to upgrade. No stone available. being used. there. That's a stone. Do that so they can build on it. Pop that in there so they can build on it. here. Yeah, we can't upgrade that further, but we can just uh, expand it out. There we go. We've completely changed that side of the island there. That's, I just find that really cool. That's making plus six, so we're good on stone. We're okay on workers, but we should be getting more workers. 
plus eight there. It's the iron, so we have no iron coming in at the moment. So let's see um, if I can go up here. There's a question mark over that ship. Got an iron bottleneck after we lost skipping that fight. Oh, it disappeared. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, we're now at war with uh, Naughty Lock, Athalus, Ascalus. There's a raider fleet there. Temple of the Hidden Tears is up there. Let me click on the map. Move around. Big ass map. New remit. To our south, stargazer over there. Let's uh, head down to these islands and see if there's anything there. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, they're coming down. Okay, well, that's fine. We'll be back in time for that. There's the wood. Really, there's nothing on these islands. in this area at all okay well we're gonna head up this way maybe maybe there's something further down but it's fine we need to go deal with the threat I don't want to use that outpost now because we're at war with them. Oh, it's an airship as well. Sweet. Oh, it's multiple airships. Okay. the DACA. Beautiful. They're bombarding the ship. They're doing actually really well against that ship. Surface threat neutralized. We didn't lose much in that at all. Um, okay. I guess I hit up there. Anomaly has been spotted in the distance. Head there. Sure. To remember to drop the gun tower. Hostiles! And the guns, yes, I would.
Shoot that guy. Enemies defeated, their splinters scattered. <clears throat> okay. So what is that done for us? We are now experienced. Mechanics unlocked new surveyor classes that you can choose to be your main surveyor. You can change your surveyor here. Ah. So I don't have mechanics. But do you have a gun tower? Blah. So you can choose which one you're going to drop there then. Previous drop of a building F and R. Okay. Good to know. Oh, I'm gonna have to. <clears throat> that looks um interesting. We we com we com we the speakers of the sacred steps have seen better days. But I'm proud of what my people have accomplished to end the war. We brought those together to speak that needed to be heard, and we are now available to help ease your factional tensions. Sure. We can get people back. That will be handy. All right, we'll go. Hopefully, get this guy here. <coughs> Trader. You are a lifesaver. So are you, Jesus. Perfect. <clears throat> that is perfect. We can uh, get things up and running again. We're under fire. As far as I'm aware, friendly fire is the thing. to be able to prioritize the target. So we can build an outpost in um, these areas. Oh, maybe not. Yep, yeah, in those areas. Okay, we need to go to our iron place and then get your man as the thing. 
Who are you? My ship and kin have served <coughs> Dunkel for generations. Excuse me. Dunkel is no more. You enrolled an officer. When a mighty warship defend your trade routes. Good. Where the hell am I going? I want to go over there. Then we'll add okay, in these other buildings. Can't wait to find... Got my own run, just need to find time. Oh, yeah. It's... It's, it's fun. It's fun and chill, and I'm kind of... I will only carry iron and workers for our industry. Iron I transport is helping our settlement grow and prosper. I want to see where it goes with everything. I serve to protect our people. I will patrol and defend here. My ship stands in good order. <laughs> She's ready to defend this trade route. So we're going to put her on that trade route because it's our um, westernmost side right now. Then we're going to go over to our other place. There's another ship over there. Just workers, but that's fine. A little bit wonky there, but okay. Um, right. Is that the church thing? Sure. Buildings on the horizon. Okay, it's not what I clicked. Oh, I, I left clicked, not right clicked. <laughs> right. Oh, wait, have I screwed that? I can connect to that one, I can't connect to this one. Oh. There it is. Don't mind it. It was just me being wonky. Can I upgrade that? Not at the moment. That's fine. Uh, right. What else was I going to do? I was going to put a gun placement down. Wait, what? What's going on over there? Hold on. Yeah. What is up over here? Also, there's... Let's see. Yeah, that's our errors. But it's someone else built here. Good day. You might not happen to need a master mason. I can oversee your stone production and improve it significantly. Sure. So this is now ours. Beautiful. Perfect. It needs workers anyway. Um, okay. Oh, wait, it's automatically connected over there. Oh, it's connected to the new settlement. Hmm. 
didn't really want it to connect there. Wants it to connect here. there as well. Stop it. <laughs> this is the only thing. Is, um, why can't I do that? It's close to another harbor. Okay. When he's spinning around a point, it does get hard to, uh, I'll ferry your workers anywhere, if you'll let me. What I want. Is that all I have left? Um Yeah, she's the only one I don't have assigned. Okay. So I'll go there. Put down my gun tower. The floating ship. We must have that technology. We are but humble refugees, many from the great imperial houses. Yeah, we're going imperial. See if we can fire this guy. Oops. Who are you? Seems I have finally found that rumored safe haven, and what a sorry sight. Where are your gunships, your corvettes? Where is your fleet? Truly, my services are urgently needed. This here is an ironclad steam rig. Not many of these around anymore, and she is for hire. We seek a new patron, new waters to guard. Sure. <clears throat> also, we're going there. Uh, you have a feeling we're going to get attacked. You don't want to be circling around like that because he'll never get his guns trained on the targets. That's okay, that was them. I thought that was our guy, because the colors. Can I change my colors? Just because. <laughs> Coming a thing. Um, so you're going to get stone once we can get a... We can get um ship to take it over there. Okay. Um 
That harbor has nothing going on. I could get you workers from that harbor, I guess. Can I connect them on the map? Probably not. This place has nothing going on at the moment. It is creating wood. Even though your man said there was no wood here. Ah, there's no wood there. It's not traveling to there. Yeah. So I do need to connect that. There's no wood here. I'll ferry your workers and there's no one around for me to transport. It's quiet on both sides of the trade route. Can I get you another trade route though? Did it just jump us to the other one? Oh, that's interesting. That's one thing I'm not sure of then is, um... How can I connect that to there? that is only connected to there so I've made a thing here so do I just create another oh wait a minute did this just um oh it snaps you to the next okay fast travel haha all right we'll deal with that in a second Why is that saying 59? Nope. Oh, here we go. Can't believe there is no access to wood nearby. <clears throat> Okay. Because it's not getting there. That, that makes sense. Okay. Oh, I want to select the actual... Go. Boom. Now it's traveling there. <clears throat> So we can actually export wood from here now. Hmm. 
means you should be able to patch there, no? Okay. And attach there, though. Lack of metal? I don't want to build it with metal. I want to build it with wood. No access to wood nearby. Oh my god, you're killing me. So I'm gonna get rid of this then. Get rid of this. And then I want to build a harbor. Are we still under attack? Oh, they're launching another one. That's okay. There we go. Yes, that is... Okay, so it's the last two harbors that you built. So I need to take the one off this harbor. Things are good. There's no one around for me to transport. I'll ferry your workers anywhere. Your work. There's lots of traffic, but I will continue to carry my passengers safely across. It's like the good old days. Right, there we go. We've got that going. That's a route that goes right across there. So I could probably... I'm going to fly down. I'm going to take the um, combat ships off of the other routes and put them onto that long route. Pathways are key. The more, the better. I saw once that you need to expand around your resource points so workers can build houses found. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you want to build as much as possible. And they, they, they do point that out in the tutorial. All about connections and stuff. The more connections, the better. Oh, Jesus. What's going on here, lads? Yeah, I want to take um the ionite transport is helping our settlement grow and prosper. My ship stands in good order. She I serve to protect any pirate would do well to avoid my guns. I will sweep this trade route clean. Just say the word. <clears throat> Alright, we'll head over here. We'll assign both of them to this trade route. Or to one or two of those trade routes. are good I serve to protect out my ship stands in good order she's ready to defend this trade room I think I need uh, <coughs> captains that can transport wooden iron yes I do but I, I have um, wood being transported from here I only have one source of iron at the moment there's lots of traffic, but I will continue to carry my... Any pirate would... This route is acceptable. There we go. Um, the issue I have right now is that I need more actual quarries and woodmills. I don't have any extractors. I would love to know how to get more. Um, they're slowly coming down there. Cause like I have iron there. I have a, a bit of wood. Is being transported. I'm gonna go back basically um, to all my settlements and then expand as much as possible here in a minute. Let's see if I can end this war. Oh. 
Uh-oh. Tell I me mean, you didn't drop anything. Because I really did not want to drop anything there. So, can I do stuff in here now that I have um, that thing? Commanders and captains are unlocked as the population of a faction increases. Coma captains and commanders may also be unassigned and dismissed from here. So, right. What does this building do? They said they would, uh... Help. <laughs> oh, look at drawbridge. Nice. Like it. Plus, there's adding to it. All right, we'll leave that there so that uh, that can increase. If, uh, built a good bit there. Can we build any more? Turns out we can, yes. Okay, it's going to build the same thing again. Spend out that one, can't you? There we go. All right, now you. No stone available, okay. Just moving that one. <laughs> That's extended out. We want to upgrade that a little later. That's that place done. 
could do another connection there. Not much more we can do with that. Um, they're staying up there for now. I need to upgrade the Imperial Town. That's uh, not doing too hot. Let's upgrade this. Did I get a commander? Am I being really dumb here? Did I get a commander? No. Okay. <clears throat> I may still be really dumb, but I did not get a commander. I uh, will leave that as it is now. Is there anything else I can do here? Yes. It looks very wooden. Okay, we have iron, so... I guess I can upgrade my tower, but I won't let me upgrade my tower, so... Shenanigans are afoot. Just stuff going everywhere there. That's fine. You're not doing anything. Can we upgrade to you? No. <clears throat> so that they've built along the wall there. Nice. Like, yeah, Minas Tirith on the water, right? Excuse me. Mm, okay. <clears throat> That's about all we can do there. Uh, reach population, reach a free house population of 2,500. Okay, we've done that, all right. Excuse me. Terrible coughs. We're gonna max this tower. that done.
Oh, interesting um, stuff going on there. Why did that happen? Okay, so that's that one. A little bit more built there. Lovely. I could not build a tower there. I could build across that way. building out of wood because we didn't upgrade it. So we'll upgrade that. Then we upgrade that. Nice. I've got to remember that. that uh, It does it from the tower you're building from. It doesn't matter that you have iron here. If uh, you don't... side are they going to come from? That's my place. I can put a harbour there. And I can put a gun tower there. Which I will. Expand around that? No. I could put another tower out here, though. Just gonna expand the hell out of this place. it there. What do we think of our uh, capital? Is it getting there? Okay, we need to go and go up this place. <clears throat> Get it actual resources and everything. I need a port from here to the Imperial place, because like that place is, look at that place. Compared to here. <laughs> You don't have, yeah, you don't have wood. I need to get wood here. <clears throat> so, I need to get wood here. Um, can I, this one doesn't, I need to demolish this port this port here and connect it to a port here yeah well, what's this one doing trade is good and steady but you are transporting wood what
You have workers in the other places. What? So I'm gonna. This ship will haul anything and everything. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do everything. Yeah, okay. So you should be connected to the capital. So I need to get rid of this dock and that dock. I'm gonna get rid of that. I'm barging it, but don't worry. We'll get rid of this one. And we're gonna connect directly to the capital. You're not really needed. Then we've extended the capital around. So we could put in a board there. This ship will haul anything and everything. Good. Um yeah, and you're going from there to that colony. The free build mechanic looks really neat. It is. That it's kind of all based around that. I like it. You kind of put out balconies. Each of the symbols um, denotes something, and when you load up the game, it shows you. Um, don't know whether that's in the game. Go floor up and floor down? Oh, hold on a minute. I, I need to utilize that too, don't I? Oh wait, game up. Maybe. You'll need the four earth sea resources to gain access to all building options. There are workers. Workers bring life, wood, yeah, iron. We have all we have access to everything. The, uh, there we go. I'm better rewards and encounters, units or buffs over that there it is so the harbor a tower a building not possible different types of foundations and upgrade the current building trade routes command towers there's a bunch of other stuff cool. so we're going to build another harbor here actually play the game properly That is now connected. Well, I should be able to do this. Aha! Harbor Origin. This ship will haul. Trade is good and steady. Good. We'll do the thing. So, now. We should be getting everything. Upgrade this to wood or stone. Start, um, Building a few towers around the uh, thing. All right, we have to wait for more resources. That is perfectly fine. We've got a good start here now. <clears throat> because these are Imperials, do they have a different... Um, Isle. That would be cool. Upgrade that. 
make a connection. Go here, we're gonna make another connection. Oh, it won't let us, okay, it's too far. Oh, there we go. <laughs> But I don't like that connection. I would prefer that connection to be stone. There we go. Do another connection across there. Oh yeah, R and F. Okay, there's nothing on this. That means I should be able to go back to like my command towers um, <clears throat> in the main city that have been built up. And uh, do that. Go to stone. Space for houses. Population's already gone up to 170. It was stuck at 40 because we couldn't uh, upgrade for ages. too far. Rich and wild center population aligning with the Imperial Remnant. This will attract new Imperial captains and commanders to our banner installing these people will increase our alignment to the Remnant further. Excellent. We hit the 200 population. Making some actual progress. Uh, so if you move the camera around, it takes a, a minute to settle back on the building. Excellent, we have iron as well. I say, like, oh, that is a different style of building. That's cool. Take a couple of citizens to run, I guess. I'll leave that there and we'll upgrade this to iron. Oh, no, there's no iron left. That's a good start on that one, I think. Like I said, some actual progress has been made. What's this? 
Why is that orange? There's lots of traffic, but I will continue to carry my... Trade is good and steady. Ah, uh, risky route. Okay. That's what I was thinking. Uh, do I have another person, actually? I don't. Trade is good and steady. Fine, though. It is, it's, you know, quote-unquote risky, but it's not. Um... Wants to go up there. Actually, before we do that, let's just pop on here. Make sure that we're all good. Rest assured, friend. My will be. Head up to the Temple of the Hidden Tears. Keeping an eye out for resources and stuff on the way. A resource Connolly ahead. Ooh, look at this place. Ooh, look at this place. This place has a uh, commander in it. Admiring the Mount's advancements, eh? Sad it took four decades of war to get here, and now it's going to waste because so many have left us. We will send out I but in exchange for your stone. Would that suit you? We could do that. We could do that. Trading harbor requires resources which can be exchanged for goods or mercenaries. Be sure to build a connecting harbor, finding the right captain that will provide the required outgoing and exchanged income resources. Okay, cool. So we can um, send it stone and get iron from it if we want. We're not like locked into that though, are we? We're gonna fly around the back of that other place. They have uh, dragons or drakes. Send your flagship to deal with them. How do I do that? They're actually raiding that. This is my surveyor. This is not my flagship though, is it? We have, um, these two here. Oh, you can literally just unassign them. Okay. So if it's a risky route, it can spawn pirates. Seems to be the think in there. Oh, 
we're so far away. I need to hire more people. Now with the tree though, it looks like there's a limit. Wait, did my guy win? I think my guy won. Must have been air units attacking him. Good job. Right then, let's uh, head down to this set of islands here. The Super Mr. Popo. Thank you for the follow, how are you going? That's gone back up to orange. Oh, well, lighter orange. Was red while that pirate is around. Must resist the urge to procrastinate and play. Dang it. <laughs> I know the feeling. I have to go to work. Soon. Wood here. I've always liked to get out ahead. Wooden stone here, okay. So this would be a half decent place. Bunch of wooden stone around, okay. Um, let's head over to Stargazer here. I'll note this place to be somewhere that we could actually um, set something up. I need to figure out how to get more of these. I guess I have to find masons and stuff. Iron out here in the middle of the ocean as well. So it's kind of wanting you to explore and um, find all these places. And all the little substantial settlement in the distance. Oh wow. Yes, substantial and they have a Hefty defense force. Not acceptable. We decline. We are low on fuel. We decline. Such packs can only be entered by someone we would consider an ally. We are low on fuel, but have plenty of labor from our young recruits. We are willing to trade them for wood by the trade harbor. I'll set it up. Yeah, I'll we'll set it up. Plenty of resources around here. 
over in the reach. Uh, we're going to head up to here. See if we can um, make peace with the feckers. They're shooting at us. Oh, wow. A hostile settlement on the horizon. I... This may have been an issue. Ooh, look at that one. Suddenly, the same color as us. By the way, we're winning. <laughs> Supposedly. Are they actually mine? Do I have that many? Does he call them in at the start of a battle or something like that? No, he's definitely shooting at me and I'm shooting at him. dodge the enemy fire which is nice or you can run into it all one they're aiming at. That one. Oh, that was one of theirs as well. Okay. We lost our airship then. Almost oh, finished him off. I think we just need to take out the turrets. Yeah, we need to take out the turrets. I'd like turrets. The loop, the loop. Move out further so that we can get a, a straight run and just get the guns aligned. You should do it from here. Line him up. There we go. You'll hit it eventually. Join you? <laughs> Only. Let it be known that we bring our ships to bear on our common enemies and no longer upon our own. Deal. Truce has been agreed, but any new aggression on our part will escalate the conflict back to its previous state. That's all right. Pirate raids have come to an end, have they? Have they?
then there's the mall. We'll fly down there later. So I'm wondering then, because I have two, they wanted wood down. They wanted wood, so I could do a trade port there. I don't have a ship to do it though, so I need to go exploring. So we'll head up here. Our forces are a little bit depleted though. Oh, never mind, surface threat neutralized. Resource colony ahead, indeed. Iron, eh? <laughs> oh, no, stone. mate. You are funny. You wish to partake in our iron and steel. We'll send over some stone through this here trade harbor. We won't touch your trading ships, we promise. Um. Uh, let's set that one up. Ah, question mark. There we go. Been looking for more of them. And then we'll head back, and we need to look at Smelly Log Floater. See what the story is there. We have to expand that. No, I did not name the city. You do not. Salutations. It appears that my previous patronage has neglected to supply our station here and has left us stranded. So, can I just pick that up then? Is this how I pick up um, a wood mill? I'm, I'm gonna try it. He's missing access to workers. Okay, well, what if I do this and then do this? I go to here and say inventory I do have one new wood bill okay great I know there's wood down there I want to get but uh, we'll fly down to here The resource thing doesn't work on this screen, nope. Oh, if I hover over them, does it? Oh, you can fast travel just like that? Oh my god. Ship has entered air waters. It's marked on the map. I, I kind of want the ship first before the combat. I'm on contract from House Mercius, but that might include a steady commission. Excellent. Their little imperial city growing.
we, we can also heal you. Take our store of herbs and tinkle. We can heal your people, giving them the dreams of their lost kin. Provide them peace and healing. This is what we have always done. We would set up a sea chantress pagodi in your settlement and spread our healing. So is that what? Yeah, okay. They're very convincing. Yeah, that's fine. Well, actually, um, let me double check that before I do. What am I actually looking at here? Oh, that's an outpost. So I have uh, a bannerless outpost, free house outpost, and an imperial outpost. So I think we want to do the free house outpost somewhere. Which I think is going to be down here, to be honest. There was wood there, wasn't there? And at least we'll be able to build up the settlement in wood. <clears throat> and we'll have a long distance trade route. I can't um, like click on him and go there, no. See what that ship is. Just put it in the middle of the water as well. Yeah. bad can happen with the uh, crumb and flying sailing Switch integration, so every now and then you'll see it. Oh, that's a battleship. You have paid for our loyalty with your actions and support for the Imperial Remnant. We are yours to command. You're definitely going to be um, controlling this area. Uh, I believe there's a D day one DLC for the Dreadnought. It's a free download. What have we got it? We're finding everything now. Exploration is exploration is key. The guild used to have surveyors, explorers, wreck divers, and more. All funded to keep trade going and expand both Freehouse and Imperium settlements. But alas, much has been lost. Perhaps you can employ some guild surveyors. Sure. out there oh okay see what we can do here so they will drop the settlement in the water between wood and the island We can drop it like there somewhere. Yeah. And then we'll drop that.
there. Perfect. That's all we need is. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Okay, hold on a minute. I think you guys can see what I'm trying to do. There we go. I don't know what the point of that bridge is, <laughs> but uh, it's there. Uh, and then we can put a harbor there if we want to, uh, which we can. Boom. I transport stone, plain and simple. This dreadnought is an inheritor of the Borgia. Uh huh. It's all great. What's over here? from the Mansard approved buyer kings. We seek permission to relocate some of our franchise to your settlement. We can offer chemical stimulants to your people. A dose of relaxation, we will find another patron. It's that simple. No, no drugs. Right, we did get a new guild. Oh, god damn it, you connected there. Of course you did. Does that mean the next thing I build is going to connect there, right? Oh, well, actually, yeah, sorry. They wanted wood, didn't they? They wanted wood for... What did you guys want? I transport stone, plain and simple. This dreadnought is an inherit. I transport. They wanted like a uh, wood for people, didn't they? Something like that. We're a very uh, Waterworld esque settlement there. Um. Right. Well, up at our capital, because everything goes to the capital. Actually, you know what? We'll put it in the Imperium City. Put the guild building here, uh, which I have to check that I'm doing the right thing. Uh, Imperium outpost, nope, I want guild surveyors. There we go. Does it actually do? I have no idea.
then upgrade it to stone. Billy Burger. Can we connect to here? Can you do one over there? You can. Might as well do that. That. a few houses there. So how do I see what this does? Buildings on the horizon, yep. Yeah. How do I see what that building does? Um, the building is on there. Oh, right, building has popped up here. Okay. remnants i presume the fires of the red mouth orthodoxy welcome you and we wish to bring the glory of the holy or to your settlement sure we got another ore miner basically for free i transport stone plain and simple cool did that, yeah, that connected straight up to there. Hmm. You're doing iron. So I probably want to get rid of this, right? Let's do this. travel here and pop down another harbor here. I transport stone. Alright, so that is connected. Oh wait, no. They wanted stone. They didn't want um, iron. Nice. You get the idea. So we can do one from here. I think I want to build more towers. Although it looks like the population hasn't... Um, gone crazy. Where Citadel is plus 11. Um, right, so we're going to do, yeah, harbor here. I transport stone, plain and simple. My hold is full and the route seems safe. Yeah, go do that. So we'll start transporting stone up there. Which is hilarious because they have stone right there. Um, Hey, who are we to judge? Upgrade and then connect. 
Connect. And... Expand her in. Can't expand that way at all. That's fun. You're kind of rooted in there too. But you can do a little bit. Person won't mind that uh, over their house at all. Okay, so that's that expansion. That's also stabilized. Um, I'm gonna say it's stabilized there. Hey, Delveth. defend themselves. It's always nice. Not at all surprising. Um oh yeah I played the I played the demo a while back and I was very uh very much looking forward to it. Flying birds with, uh, like bird riders with lasers. We're shooting our own town here, it's fantastic. But I'm happy to have not surprised you. A well made game will always catch my eye. Splinters scattered. Excellent. Roy, I need more ships. We have that trade route there looking for the wood. I don't have anyone to transport the wood. We do have currently got someone um, going north with the, the stuff. The thing. I'd love to know more about this. And I should probably to the game help. In the screen da, 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 shows you commanders and captains in your service should potentially free commanders and captains and how much population you need. Oh, I need to look at that a bit more in depth. Combat's fairly straightforward. Your battle group will engage any enemy units close to your surveyors and lay waste to them. Additional forces may support your enemies during and after combat. The health of your battle group in comparison to your enemies shown the health bars during combat. Um, each individual unit gains experience from every fight. You lose the unit um, you may gain more after a cooldown period from the commanders that spawn them. Always start off as rookies and therefore, okay. For settlements, yep. So they're at war with each other. Random events we know about. Um, command towers, traders, and building. Commanders also use utilize balconies by placing defensive turrets on command towers. Maximum height effect. Okay, so if they're if we have a commander in a tower, they'll place defenses on them. Gotcha. So our capital has a bit of defenses. In that one?
Oh yeah, this is then. Yeah, let's go up to the top floor. Should be good. <clears throat> Rest assured, friend, my warbirds are the strongest and fastest. Yo, they don't look like defenses, goddammit. Go down a couple of levels. Yeah, depending on the level you're on with the R and F keys, um, you'll get different. Items. Oh, there's a defensive thing down there. I see it. Unless it's just a crane. Um, there's a bunch of guns going up now. Well, in some parts. Keeps rebuilding the same thing. I need to upgrade, <coughs> upgrade that to iron. And then it puts up guns. Oh, okay. Interesting. So is that upgraded? It's probably not because I built it when it was stone. So now you see it's actually putting up a defensive turret there. That is interesting. So we can have a like fortified city. It's definitely worth upgrading all of them to stone if you're at war. Or stone. Iron if you're at war. Okay. getting transported over to there yet just there that is not what I wanted to do it's very pretty isn't it I, li I really like the, uh, the build style as well let's upgrade that to iron it's, it, I think it is really well done very um played whatever way you want i uh, shouldn't have done that because i hadn't upgraded the tower yet and 
Yeah, we upgrade that. That's what I wanted to do. There we go. Now we've got iron going across to this tower. So we can upgrade it. Excellent. And then we do one across here. Now we have guns everywhere, by the way. <laughs> That's the only reason I'm doing this. Is... And if I do this... it out there and then if I do that does that I need to connect them but then if I did this it would just build that oh no building on this as well which is good then we're going to build all the way back in in one. That's a nice expansion to our capital. Yeah, the, the, the mouse controller is, is a little bit funky sometimes raiding party not for long they really like that route so we might put the dreadnought on that route yeah they like that Ship, though. It's that uh, I need to go back down to Smelly Place. Uh, 
And do we actually have a command tower here? I don't think we do. Like the metals, okay. Sign a commander. Well, install me at a tower connected to a wood mill, so I can increase the production of high quality timber. Production's booming and quality's up. We are delivering the finest sea tree wood this side of Solid Mount. Great. Um, but you don't have stone or iron. That's an issue for me. That harbor. Oh, that's right. That's connecting all the way up there, but it's not getting much. Okay, and that iron is not being utilized yet. Okay. We've got her. So we technically have the ability to get these two. That's a um, stabler, so that's uh, an aerial unit. That looks like a naval unit. We also opened relations with the Mansers, which we haven't even gone up. Alrighty. It's Salad Mount, because that's the name of the commander that we can get. So I'm going to guess he's there. Something there, though. I'm about right. It's, we, underst we understand. Our services are much... It's very possible that I command the last company of the Royal Guard freelancers in existence. We see a substantial amount of Imperial citizens amongst your own. We wish to serve and support those who still carry the Imperial banner. Hell yeah. Right, let's give her a, um, a place. Not an Imperial town. <laughs> Actually, we probably will. We'll, we'll go up here. This is our Imperial Citadel. Let's say we give her this tower. Uh, Alright, no upgrades on that.
That was the wrong button. Trying to get as much on this as I can. And then we... My company can feel... It's good to feel solid foundations again. A place for my falconeers to call home and defend with their lives. Our warbirds are at the ready. Excellent. Cool. So now we've got the Imperials and the uh, other people. <laughs> Um, we were going to do what just a second ago? We're heading up to talk to probably Salad Mount here. Let's go. That's our Imperial colony. With our trade ships. I'm just realizing right now that I never put the Dreadnought in as a protector of that trade route. Not, we are able and willing to protect this route. Excellent. That's all I need is. Also, let's go back there. Get moving. Like, I think we're doing okay. Population is like six and a half K. Uh, where are our birds? Greetings from the greetings from the Manson approved buyer kings. Uh oh, we seek to be now. We're good. Is that where somewhere was? Yeah, that's where somewhere was. So there's two boys in the water. So all of our trade routes are now safe. All is good. Uh, the, the renaissance of the great imperial age is past we fortune okay oh one of the factions become the dominant faction in your settlement which has made other factions suspicious of your ambitions if you choose to move further in this direction you might find them becoming hostile working towards better relations through trade or population might reassure them eh. Yeah, all right. There's our buddies beside us. And ahead of us. Is 
There's an anomaly in the distance, yes. Flying. Nothing. Cool. We sort of scally. Decently dependent resource colony, yeah. This area used to be the primary source of wood for the entire northern Nursey. But the markets kind of collapsed with the war and all that, you know. We're about to pack up and leave. There's nothing much keeping us here. Unless you're in need of some wood. Not really, no. <laughs> Invite settlement to join. Glad to be part of something again. Oh, great. Cool. 150 towers within one settlement. Uh, sure. That happened. Are they ours? I feel like they're ours. So, yeah, you have wood. You have no workers. You do have workers. They're just not getting anywhere. to be able to work around why did you build your damn colony out here you fools back the metals to build a structure yes that's fine I, uh, that's no there we go we have wood so we can build stuff uh, I cannot build out oh Figure this out. Can I build on top of C free or C tree? Okay. It's fine. We'll build around them though. So we need to get around the diamond trees so we can get resources over to there. Oh, that's a tower. least getting wood to over there and workers to here or well not to here but to, to itself because I need to build um, something connections built um, 
Just like that. Workers are still the issue, though. So we probably want to do a... Um, Arbor out here. Unconnected. Excellent. That's what I want. Alright, cool. We might be able to get Mansers. Sweet. Let's see what this is. It suits me that mechanic the guild has passed on permission to build you an imperial surveyor. Quite an honor. Those things are tough in a fight. Ooh. Take it. Again, I presume I get the thing after I do this. Now we have a, um, a war plane over here, though, which is kind of great. Back to the capital. Um, you're not actually looking at the cursor, you're looking at the, the icon on the water to see where your mouse actually is. Just in case you're ever wondering. Um, you there. Imperial surveyor is let's get to work people Let's Oh cool Here we go So then we can come in here Yeah, and we can switch between them here. So we now have two point defense and four heavy guns a little bit slower But a lot more health um, kind of need to go blow something up now. Go up to here. I don't know. We'll head out and that direction. Research post has not been supplied in over a year. We would go apostle. Yeah, the mansers kind of look cool, actually. They're they're the tech group. Probably place that down somewhere. Let's get into the shard, actually. Let's see what that is. Two stutters here and there, but nothing crazy. Performance has been pretty good. Oh, our, I don't think our FPS is 300. It's supposed to be locked at 144, so that could be an issue there. I didn't even look down at the thing. Primary should be V-synced at 144. That number mm. 
substantial settlement. Ooh, look at these boys. Definitely no. Hmm? Oh. We expect no such actions from someone so close. This is the entryway to Oberon's gate itself. The historic last stand of House Borgia when they opened it to the stars. The gate may now lie wrecked, but the Shard remembers. We remember the way this world existed before, and it can exist again. Interesting. We're getting close. We are the ones that close to being able to have them in our thing. All right, we'll go south down to the forge. Something on the horizon. Is the objective just to take over the map? You are aligned with the Imperial Remnant. I don't believe your people will allow this action. Before the war, the priests of Redmouth would work these forges. Now it is the Imperial Remnant and the Redmouth Forge Company. We work for profit. So yes, we can trade through a trade harbor. We will exchange workers for iron. Our mines and forges need strong arms and back. Welcome to the premier destination for advanced alloys on the Ursi. Our company, established during the War of the Tree, initially supplied all resources to Oberon's Gate and powered the expansion to the New World. Since the Gate's destruction, we have been focusing on new markets, however. Interesting. So Oberon's Gate is in the Shard and transported people to a new world and probably left the Maw. Right, we'll head up to Westgate. Anomaly has been spotted. Salutations. I have been sent to secure and protect the latest settlement to join the ranks of the Reborn Imperium. Accept us, and my Hammerhead airships are yours to command. Sure. We're going, Imperium. Pretty much. Sweet, so we now have two uh, Hammerheads with us. I think we might be doing some conquering. It looks cool, but uh, the fact that they fly so far ahead kind of puts them at huge risk in combat situations. Large settlement. Oh, that is a large settlement. Coming out of the midst there. Hello. Well, it's okay. Not like ours, but it's okay. 
We are now the oldest surviving Imperial city on the Ursi. You see before you the beauty of the ancients. Revel at what we have lost. Is it? I don't know. It's all right. Okay. By the way, clicking on the map is much easier than um, trying to mess with our middle mess button over. Things on the horizon, good stuff. Alright guys, I'm gonna have to call it there. I need to head off to work. So I do appreciate everyone hanging out. Hope you're having a good one and uh, hopefully we'll catch you again soon. I will be playing more of this, because it's very chill. But uh, tomorrow will be Kenshi, probably. Have a good one. I'll catch you again soon. I'll throw right over to someone here in a second.